<laughs> what is up, YouTube? Hello. Today, we are making a shirt. So that the husband will stop complaining that I take them all. I guarantee she takes this one. This is... I am Jamie Macon. And this is... The husband. And together we are... Your... Chalk Couture... Ringmasters. Why would not two hands? I got the two hands. <laughs> Oy. Oh, so honestly, today we are... Honestly? Because we lie to you every other time. I don't know why honestly came out. Okay, so anyway, we are making a really cool shirt for me. It's got a truck on it. Pretty cool. There is this vintage truck transfer that, like, everybody in the world absolutely loves. Uh, they tried to get rid of it years ago, and, and people revolted. So... <laughs> Bring back our trucks. Because it's cute. I mean, look at it. It's not cute, super manly. That's what I said. And it has the base layer so you can make it a color. Two tone. Go over. Yeah, like they're supposed to be. Mm -hmm. um, Sorry for me yelling at you. I'll put <laughs> the filter on and bring that down. I am excited about it. All right, All right. let's get us kicked over and let's uh, show them what we're doing. Show them what we're working with. Because we got some of the little add ons and things too. Um, put more pieces <coughs> besides just the truck on a shirt. So. We need to put a sticky mat. We do. We need to figure out how far down you want this. Oh. And the best way to figure out how far down you want this. Is to put it on. Put it on. Which, if I had thought about it before, we would have done it. We would have done this beforehand. So once you've got the shirt, <laughs> like, on you, use a little bit of placement tape. And I usually like to put it at the very, very top of where you want the design to go. So what do you want it like right here? Sure. Because then your truck will be here. Okay. Oh, right there. Thanks, babe. No problem. Okay. That can also sort of give you center as well. Whoa. And then we do need a sticky mat. So this is one of our Chalk Couture ink mats. <clears throat> its entire purpose in life is so that you don't bleed through to the backside of your shirt. <laughs> and it has a handy dandy little sticky bit to it so that your shirt doesn't work, uh, wander around on you either. Which, shirts are not supposed to wander. Shirts don't wander. Well, they don't wander with a sticky mat. I was gonna say, they do if you don't use a sticky mat. Yeah. It actually is as you're trying to pull your paste or ink across there. Mm -hmm. All right. So here's a pro tip with the truck. Center is not center. <laughs> like the actual oh, transfer yeah. is, but like the bed of the truck is a little bit longer than like the front. It, you want to like, you want to make this center because that's the center of the door, but it's not. It's actually a little more right there. Hmm. So. Yeah. Plus, you got the tree hanging out the back. That was 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 gonna be my next step. I know. Sentence. So this is what we're gonna put. We've got this little tree. You can see we've used it before. It's stained. <laughs> it still works fine, but yeah. colors like um, green and Blues. blue, red, the really highly yeah. pigmented ones, stain your stuff. Yeah. It's fine. It doesn't hurt anything. It just colors the transfer. Yep. So now that has extended out past the back bumper. So now we've got this much. That much. So. It's a good layout. I think this is a little more center now. I think it was here before. I think I it's, think it's okay. Either way. Okie dokie. I'm not fussy. Well, we have to put the words on too. Oh. You gotta kind of lay it all out before you get started. Oh, I gotcha. So there's that. Then the truck. But I was going to say, yeah, your tree's going to be into your tree. Yeah. <laughs> tree to tree. Yeah. <laughs> You're a dork. <laughs> Some days. And then we've got established 1950. Do you want that under the truck or under the words? I think under the words, don't you? I'm asking you, is this your shirt? Under the words. Okay. We're going to move down even more. Yeah. There. All right. Awesome. Now we can. Now we stuff. can. Which one do you want to do first? Let's do the letters first. Yep. Okay. And actually you can do the letters on the truck. And the truck, yep. Okay, so you peel one set the corner of I'll it. Peel the truck. Do you want to just like roll the whole thing? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I was trying to help hold it. Awesome. 
And for the truck color, we're doing Storm. Yeah, because husband wanted to leave the bottom of the truck black. Husband hasn't decided. He's kind of changed his mind. I was thinking maybe the bluish. Ocean. For the bottom mist. or for the truck? For this part. Okay, we need to do that first. Oh. Husband's going to leave the bottom black. <laughs> Husband needs to make up his mind. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> you can't figure it out as you're going. So we're going to do a black and gray truck. Cause Layers don't really work figuring out as you're going. They can. Cool. I really do like the storm color. Yeah. Looks good. Okay. Well, now that we have the blue, I'm kind of thinking the bluish, what do we call it? Ocean mist for letters. Okay. Yeah, I think we're going to do ocean mist for letters. And I'm going to use a big squeegee this time so it goes <laughs> faster. Because that's a fur. Oh, oh. 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 It's brand new. Ooh. Ah. That's a baby squeeze. So this is a good learning moment. Mm -hmm. When you get a new ink or a paste, well, that's a lie. If, when you get a new ink, you don't have to do nothing to it. <laughs> Scrape all the extra off of the lid and craft and create. You're ready. You're done. That's it. Whereas with paste, you have to mix it and stir it. Yep. Get all the air pockets out. It'll actually sound, it'll sound like Rice Krispies. It'll snap, crackle, and pop when you mix it. It's great. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <coughs> Ooh. See, now that's, you just gotta have the big squeegee. Yeah. It's Mess so around that little squeegee <laughs> snug. <laughs> Oh, we didn't tell you the pro tip. When you are working with ink, always check your fingers before you pull transfers up. Because <laughs> quite frequently, you'll get it on you. Yep. At least we do. Oh, all the time. All the time. It washes off of water, so it's not a problem. But the problem is when you go to stick your fingernail under that and you have paste or ink on your finger, and now you've ruined your shirt. Well, you can get it off. If it's really wet and you do it really quick, it's not easy. Yeah. Ta-da! Ta-da! Peel and reveal, babe. Ooh. And we can put in the established. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Or are you going to do that, husband? I don't know. Papaya would look real nice. <laughs> You're hell-bent on me using that papaya. I am. Why? <coughs> Just because. Because I do stuff in two tones and that's it. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty proud of you for picking the barely blue. <laughs> it's going to have green. It's because it's a tree. <laughs> nope, it's going blue. I tried. I couldn't get there. Uh, sigh. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's got to balance you out. You got so much color. I just got to be. Maybe I have to have so much color. You think? I do. It's in my bones. Okay, pull it. Bing. Boy, it looks very similar on camera, doesn't it? Yep. This is very much more blue than this one. Okay. But they work together because they're the same tone. Right. Same thing with the papaya and the um, green. They're all kind of muted. They're... Not super bright? 
saturated but not mute but not bright hmm okay we're gonna heat it up hair dryer will make this process faster because otherwise you need to wait for the ink to dry before you put any other layers on which our layer is the jesus tree that's washed tree. out here we go <laughs> Magic of television. Magic of television <laughs> editing. Okay, now a little green on the tree. Yep. Um, hey, did you guys know that you don't have to fuzz your transfers when you're working on fabric? Because it's fuzzy. Mm -hmm. Can't yeah. tell you how many times I've still reached for a transfer or a fuzzing cloth when we're doing ink. Got it where you like it? I think so. It's a very good pine tree color. Mm -hmm. It's just the right green. Pesto. Pesto. Pine tree pesto. Yep. This tree. Now, does this tree have the snow parts on it? It does. Ah. That's what I was actually just going to say. Oh, yeah? So the, the names, the established, and the tree are all part of the vintage truck winter add-on and there's um snowboards and a whole bunch of uh just all the winter stuff to go with this truck so you can kind of do different things um, and this transfer in particular the trees there's three pieces to it so you have the the dark green then there's a snow layer and then there's another um just little green layer that you can add and give it some real depth. I told you, you can't <laughs> all over me. I like it. You did good, husband. I'm not allowed to touch anything anymore. Nope, you're not. <laughs> Paper towels are over. It's fine. I can press the. I don't think we really need to touch anything anymore because nope. now we just have to let it dry completely, and then um, he set it with a. Well, we use a Cricut Easy Press because Jamie doesn't iron, and. Uh, Actually, we ironed this shirt with the cricket. Before Smooth we it out a little bit so it's smoother. <laughs> awesome. All and right, guys. Well, thanks for hanging out with us. Thanks. If you enjoyed this, subscribe. Hit subscribe. Hit the little bell for the notifications. Any questions you got, too, feel free to ask us. Either on that, the that number. number or in the comments. Yeah. Awesome. Thanks, guys. <laughs>